Hello everybody, in this course you will learn how to use NetMiko module for network automation. I will examine the NetMiko in four parts. First, connect network devices with SSH protocol. Second, send command to the network devices. Third, get configuration logs to the file. Fourth, collect device alarms to the Excel file. Let's start. First, I am creating a new project. Uh, which name is NetMiko. Then also I'm creating one Python file. I will use one simulator uh, to connect uh, one router. First I open router and cloud means uh, now I will uh, bind my real laptop adapter, network adapter to uh, this virtual cloud and I can directly connect from my laptop to router. Uh, as you see that one dot, as you see that 192.168.2.150 not reachable now. Uh, now I'm giving IP address to the router. 192.168.2.150 I connect my laptop adapter to the router. Then it's pingable. Also, I have to open a such router as such, and I'm making a such configuration. In this section, I, I'm using Huawei routers and this configuration related with Huawei devices. Okay. Device part is finished. Now I'm adding NetMiko module our code, our script. I will use connect handler function from the NetMiko module. I'm specifying device information. Device type Huawei. Host 192.168.2.150. We, all, we already configured the device. Also, we can keep device information in one uh, text file and get from there. But in this example, I only connect one device and I will write here. Username admin, you already set in the device. And password is admin123. Delay factor, we have to define delay factor because if we get uh, so many logs, so many requests from device, and it should be some delay. Otherwise, uh, maybe there will be some interrupts or maybe we cannot get uh, all the logs correctly. It can be some data lost. Okay, now we are connecting device with NetMiko module. And I will write two parameters. And first one, I want to display device version. Uh, this is the this 
command related with uh, display. Second one is related with configuration. Uh, it will go to the interface gigabit ethernet 001 and it will write IP address 1.1.1.1 slash 24. It will set this IP address to the gigabit ethernet 001. Okay. Our output will be equal to config commands and I put 0 0.2 second delay. And after finish, NetMiko will be disconnect. And I want to see our output in the command line. Also, I'm creating one output text file. Also, I want to see my configuration here. I define x variable. It will it will get information from the file in the output text, and I will write okay. As you see that it takes some times, but uh, when we can see display version informations also reset. 1.1.1.1 in the gigabit than 001. Let me check from the device. As you see that already set. IP address 1.1.1.1. And also create output file. We can see our display version information and also interface gigabit than 001 configuration. Also, we can use uh, import a login module to get uh, more detailed uh, logs from the NetMiko. Because sometimes uh, when we try to get some uh, more logs, uh, we can only get some uh, specific information, not uh, all the configurations. Uh, but if you use NetMiko login, modules, uh, we can see, we can debug and we can find more log here. Let me start again. I run the our scripts again and it's taking a few minutes, a uh, few seconds, sorry. Then finish. As you see that it's create new output log file. This is the NetMiko uh, log debugging channel, uh, we can we can see more log belongs to the, our device, our routers. As you see, that's all the information. Also our requested logs and configurations in the below side. Also, I will try to get uh, memory information and ARP information which belongs to the device. I will let before configuration which I made. And in second part also, uh, I wanna open our output txt file. First we will get display memory and display ARP information. Then in this list, I wanna find uh, in the specific line, which 
we start from the memory using percent which is and after this uh, it should be memory person's number value so uh, this is the only array find all module uh, will only find digits from the line and second one also it will try to find total ARP number then it will write memory it will add memory with append to the index 0 of the list and also it is same with Mac then print our memory value and make number in the list items normally keeping as a string but now I will convert it to integer and if our memory value equal less equal than 70 send us some information and say that this is the normal but else send me abnormal if it's up to 71 or upper it, it will send me abnormal Also, I'm making same if as statements for Mac. If total Mac number greater or equal than four, so send me normal. As yeah, this is abnormal. And I will use also pandas module to create an Excel files. Also, it will keep all the data, all the information in the Excel file. And also memory alarm side. We will see memory alarm. And it means we will see normal or abnormal. Also, we have to write for Mac. We have to see Mac access count, Mac access number, total number, and it will put this information index zero of the list. And also, we will see result normal or abnormal. And I want to print data frame and create one excel which name is output.xlss we have to create one excel which name is output.xlsx uh, yes uh, here also i have to add list for mac and also for the memory also for memory alarm and Mac alarm. I have to create four list because we will keep all the data in that list and then we will write in the Excel file. Okay, still seems some error. I'm trying to find it. Okay, now it's okay. Okay, here you go. First, we send display memory command, then display ARP. Now it's connecting to device. Yes, uh, it's get two data memory usage is device memory usage 79, and there are also total two ARP, uh, two MAC address, as you see that from the device, two MAC address and memory using first, which is. 79 so according to our secret if our statements memory usage 79 is normal 
we are getting normal alarm uh, also uh, sorry 79 is uh, abnormal because greater than 70 uh, for, but for mega this we are getting uh, normal so also we can see in the excel file thanks for watching